When referring to this building over the years, I would call it Dundalk Center or Ten Dozen Way. And then when I'd get that puzzled look, I would simply say, you know, the old Y building. And people would instantly know the building I was referring to. Well, today it has a new name. The Dundalk Community Center, or I suppose we could call it the new Y building, which I'm sure the folks from the Y would just love. But as you'll hear from our speakers this morning, the building will house many more activities and programs, and will once again have a prominent place in the lives of Dundalk residents. So to begin our program, would everyone who's able please stand? Of all the young people in Dundalk. 
and it does make a very critical crime to see this building redone, opened up, and have the same opportunities we had when we were young people. So I'm very proud of thank Jim Smith and the whole county the government for their involvement in Dundalk as a whole. And I'm, again, very proud of being here this morning, and it's awful hot to be here. Thank you. <laughs> You know, Sonny mentioned that when he was a teenager, this was a social hub. When I was a teenager, I don't think we wanted this to be the social hub. Uh, but I am pleased that now as an adult, I'll be able to take part in some of the activities here. Um, and at a point when my wife and I have kids, this can be something they can enjoy as they grow up as well. Just, just to note that really we're starting to see the holistic approach of addressing that renaissance go through improving our educational infrastructure, our social and recreational infrastructure, and even our housing infrastructure through work like the DRC bringing in great new opportunities for young working professionals and moving in the community, which will really contribute to long-term vibrancy in this area. I'm just really excited that these will be a part of so thank you all for coming out and for all you do for our communities. Um, thanks and welcome. And I guess those are the two key things I want to say today. I want to thank everyone who was involved in, in getting this building back in shape. I learned to swim in the pool that was right next door. Uh, I look forward to so many people learning to swim in this new facility. Uh, I want to echo what everyone has said. I want to thank the county, the state, and federal officials for making this possible. In particular, Jim Smith, our councilman of Chesty. Um, I also want to thank Harry Harvey, the Office of Community Conservation, who helped lead a lot of this and helped us try to figure it out. None of this would have been done with all of their help and dedication. So thanks to all of you. <laughs> Welcome to the new facility. Um, it's great to see a facility where, as was pointed out, everyone from children to seniors and hopefully everyone in between can come, enjoy the pool, enjoy the facilities. Welcome to the line. Uh, I know this is a county facility. I'm sure most of us are going to continue to call it not the old one. Or maybe we'll call it the new line. Um, it's just sort of, we are all very excited to have you here. We look forward to working with you in additional programming. Um, it is hot, welcome to the Dumbo Pool and Sauna. Um, enjoy your time here. I hope to see many of you here in the future. Thanks. Thank you. 